So we're all looking for ways to beat the heat, but our morning cup of joe is really usually very hot. So I'm gonna show you how you can make a cooled down latte slush and not have to go pay $5 for somebody else to make it for you. So I've just got two cups of hot coffee here and I'm just gonna put in about a half a cup of milk. And this is just some sugar and a little bit of cinnamon and chili powder. So it's an icy hot latte slush. So you're getting a little heat from the spices. And just get this all mixed up. And so you wanna stir it until your sugar is dissolved. Your cinnamon and your ancho chili powder is still going to be a, just a little bit clumpy, but that's fine because it'll all get mixed in later when you, when you mix it up in the blender. So all of our sugar is mixed in, and you're just going to pour this into your ice trays. So instead of putting ice in that's, water, that's you know, normally water, your ice is your coffee, so your coffee won't be watered down. So we're going to get this all poured in, and then it's usually best to go ahead and let this freeze overnight. So do a few trays of these so that you'll have plenty on hand. So now I've got some that are already frozen and I'm just gonna get this blended up. And first I wanna go ahead and put in just a little bit of milk or you can put in a little bit of water, whatever you like, just to kind of get some, some friction going. Okay, I think this is to the consistency that I'd like for it to be. It's nice and creamy, kind of velvety, almost, almost like a Slurpee. So we're just gonna get this into our cups. And it's just like your latte that you would normally enjoy that's, that's usually hot. All the same ingredients, but a little bit of spice, but nice and cool for this summer heat that we've been ha experiencing. And then if you're so inclined, just a little bit of whipped cream on top. And there you go. So you can find this recipe in Wednesday's Tyler Paper Food section or on CBS19.tv.